Hello and welcome to my channel all about decoupage. Hi, I'm Veronica and today's video is a collaboration with this Southern Girl Can. So after watching my video, go check out her video on her channel. It would be the newest video she has available and it will be this kind of wooden easter egg decorated i am decorating it with decoupage she will be doing something else with it so for this video i chose wooden easter egg with a frame i painted the easter egg twice with white paint let it dry between each layer this wooden egg is also available on this Southern Girl Can website and I will be putting the link in description box below as well. With the same white paint, I also painted the frame of the egg as well. I only painted it once because I wanted to do something else with the frame. Of course, let it dry. I chose this design with mushrooms. Apparently mushrooms are very popular this Easter season. So I have this rice paper printed. I have the images from Etsy and I cut out my images with water pen. And if you don't have water pen, just use small amount of water and brush. Then I use my decoupage glue to glue the images onto the easter egg of course you can use matte posh as well so firstly i applied a little bit of decoupage glue onto the egg itself then i placed the image and then i glued it with more decoupage glue making sure there is no excess because that will dry out white not clear and i glued both sides at the same time so i made sure it was not lying flat because that way I would be doing one side of my Easter egg. After the rice paper was dry, it was time to paint my design. So I am using acrylic paints for this and I am going inside the rice paper itself for better blending. As you can see, I am not going to the outside of the Easter egg because I will be gluing the frame onto the egg as well. So there is no need for painting the whole egg on this side. All material will be listed in description box below. Just please do note, I am in Slovakia, Europe. So most of my link will be European base. If I cannot find the same uh, material I use I will be putting something similar to it and my American followers can buy this wooden egg cutout from this southern girl can and as I was saying before I will be putting the link to her website in the description box below as well the frame I painted with red paint After painting the frame, it was time to paint the other side of my Easter egg. Of course, here I am going inside the rice paper itself for better blending. And this time I am painting the whole egg around. After everything was painted the way I wanted, I let my Easter egg dry. So in between, I sealed my frame with matte varnish. Of course, you can use glossy one as well. The varnish is water-based.
I love to use glitter decoupage glue so here it is again of course the step is fully optional and you don't have to do it if you don't have glitter decoupage glue but if you do just make sure there is no excess because it will dry out white not clear so I just applied my glitter decoupage glue on both sides of my wooden egg and after it was dry it was time to seal my easter egg so I used pouring glaze for this but of course you can use varnish or triple tick for this and I applied three to four layers let it dry between each layer and this way I am getting a nice shine with white paint and wooden pick I apply dots on my frame and to make a little bit more accent of the dots I use contour pen and then I thought it needs something more so with air drying clay and a mushroom mold I just used the cup of the mushroom and I glued it on the top of my Easter egg with express glue from Pentart of course only on the one side where the frame is and to be sure it can be hang I just make sure the a hole on my Easter egg is visible. Then I let my clay part dry. And after it was dry, I just painted it with acrylic paint. If you don't want to make your own Easter decor, I do have an Etsy shop where you can check out all designs available. Of course, I will be putting the link to my Etsy shop in the description box below. Also, this wooden mushroom Easter egg will be available in my Etsy shop as well. After it was painted, I sealed it with matte varnish. Of course, you can use glossy varnish as well for this. And here it is all finished, my mushroom wooden Easter egg. After watching this, please don't forget to pop over to Amber's This Southern Girl Can page and see what she will do with her wooden easter egg thank you so much for watching this video if you like it please do subscribe please do give me a thumbs up or a nice comment please stay tuned for more until next time bye